you just start off telling us how bad you feel this is going? Uh, yeah, we just uh, obviously didn't execute really darn offensively, John. De defensively, uh, we're on the field pretty much the whole football game. Uh, we battle, battle our tail off. We can always do things better, but I don't mind offensively. We just execute extremely poorly. Uh, some of the simple things that that you got to go do to, you know, to be successful, we didn't do them very well. Uh, yeah, that's uh, you know, it's that's a big struggle, John. You know, and uh, just just looking at it today, like I said, I mean, just some some simple execution, some things throwing and catching that we normally do pretty well, we didn't do very well. Uh, and I got no excuse for it. That's my responsibility for us to to get that done, and we haven't done it. Are you worried about losing your job after a game like this? John, my answer will never change when you ask me that. I look like you have had his worst game with the season before. Uh, well, what happens is, is as you're a young player, the more more you play, you get played different at times. And, and today, really, they, they didn't do a whole lot. They didn't play some, just a lot of too deep and, and some of those things. And just got to go out there and execute and, and uh, you know, take check downs, you know, do those type of things. So you got to play a little bit different. Uh, and, uh, you know, obviously, you can play a lot better. I got to do a better job with him. And uh, Carl's got to do a better job with him. But, uh, you know, we just we struggled. You know, we struggled to to throw and catch and do some of the simple things. All right, so season's over. Where do you go at the quarterback position? Do you see what you have in Geno? Uh, you know, I mean, yeah, definitely. We just right now we just keep going. Uh, We've got to get ready to play a great football team next week. I don't make decisions after the game. I never have, never will. You know, i got to go see why we played so poorly and, and go from there. Was there any thoughts bringing Matt in at some point today? Excuse me? Was there any thoughts of bringing Matt in at some point today? No, because I didn't have the problem I had last week. It wasn't, wasn't about the... Uh, you know, some schemes that we were doing protection-wise, that was never an issue. It was about execution. What's your takeaway on Dennis Johnson? Well, I really like what he did. He's been doing it in practice, and, uh, you know, he, he plays extremely hard. Um, you know, I think we have to be encouraged by some of the things he's done. We, he was able to hold up in some protection roles today, but, um, you know, I, I think we have to be excited about some of the things he's done as a young player. On the zone team, with Ben Jones and Wade Smith and Ron Harrison Newton, how does that affect your chemistry? Uh, well, we've been that way for a couple of years. I mean, we play uh, successful with that chemistry last year, you know, playing a bunch of people, so that hasn't changed. They didn't blitz as much today as they have in no. the past. No, no, they didn't, John. They played, played, uh, just played a lot of too deep and, and uh, came and get us a couple of times. We're in the right protection. we got to make some plays, like the one to uh, Hopkins there. And, in the fourth quarter, you know, we pick it up. We got to make those plays. But uh, when they weren't coming, we weren't doing a very good job of just executing. Is going backwards? No, I think it's part of being young, and uh, you know, as you play, every guy I've ever been around. I mean, they're talented kids. They do some good stuff, and then the more you play, the more you see, the more you know, it becomes tougher. And I think he's going through that stretch right now as a player. But uh, but he's got a lot of ability and. And as he continues to work through these things, he'll get better. You know, I know he's very disappointed today. I'm disappointed uh, at me and Carl uh, that we didn't have him, you know, better in a better position today or better prepared because I know we can handle some of that stuff better. You know, I, I don't know. i got to go back and look at it. But, I, you know, we had planned on playing DJ some, John, and when he went in, he just looked so good running the ball. So, you know, we played him a little bit more. So... That's just the way it happened. You know, Ben hasn't been practicing all week. He's just been playing for us. And, uh, you know, obviously DJ did some good stuff, so I left him in the game. Will you hear Houston, Texas, worst team in the league? What's your thoughts? Uh, yeah, I'm very disappointed we are we are right now. I mean, you know, we won two football games and, and uh, you know, lost a lot of close games over the course. And uh, uh, obviously, you know, haven't played well for various reasons. And today, offensively, we played very poorly. So, Can you get more Come more, guys. I don't understand what you're asking me. Oh well, well, I think it's pretty obvious. We've been picking up a few guys each week for the last three weeks. Yeah, so. What's the worst um, thing about where you are right now? The worst thing? The worst thing. Oh, I just feel bad for the players. Feel bad for the organization. Feel bad for for everybody that I'm looking at in that locker room, John, because they're working hard. Uh, but uh, the results aren't very good, so 
as I told them, you know, the, the person I look at is myself. That's, that's where I go. So, you know, I'm the one that's got to have us playing a hell of a lot better than we're playing. So I take responsibility, full responsibility for that. You said you last one had for the players and organization. You for yourself. No, I don't worry about myself. I've told you that over and over again. Any yeah, concern Uh, Jerome, you know, like I said, I answer that question the same all the time. I, I, don't, I don't worry about that. I don't worry about everybody else. Thank you. Thank you.